Hey, welcome to Ron J and Tenny the P. Back with the PC video for you guys. I'm gonna be showing you guys in this video how to install your CPU fan and also your thermal paste. So if you guys want to see the full breakdown on other parts on your computers, your first time building a computer, check the playlist in the description. I got a full video showing you guys how to put together your first PC. This is my first time doing it together. I could say it was very successful. So if you beautiful people are new to the channel, please be sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell icon so you get notified when I drop my next video. If you don't want to subscribe, please be sure to drop a like down so it can help people learn how to put in their CPU fans and also their thermal paste. But without any more, let's get straight into the video. Okay, and the CPU fan I'm going to be using is the CR1400. The link to that is in the description. Good price. It has an RGB light on it as well. I'm going to show you guys how to also install it so you can have the light come up. You could do the whole thing. But this is the CR1400. It's a quiet fan. I have no issues with it. Love it. Good quiet fan. It came with two different plates, as you guys can see. There's plates on it so it can fit AMD cards and Intel cards. So you have either or, and just read the description of the item. There are different cards. I'm not sure, but I know the A does AMD and Intel cards uh, plate bracket in here. So what I do is I take it out the box, as you guys can see, and then when I put, I make sure my plates are on that it fits. And I know that I have AMD, so I'm going to take and install the bracket that's for the AMD uh, CPU chip. Okay, this is a brand new motherboard. They have brackets on it by the CPU. You want to pull off these brackets. So you just unscrew them. You see how I'm unscrewing them? I pull it up. And then once I have it up, I'm going to apply my thermal paste. And when I'm applying my thermal paste, I make the letter H. And I put a little bit more in the middle. It's very thin lines so it doesn't spread off because it, like, it presses down on your CPU and kind of squeeze the paste and it's going to spread but I'm not putting too much on it to where it spreads and leaks off of the CPU so I just make the letter H that's like the most efficient letter that you can make when you're doing it I really think you're supposed to spread it across but I just make the letter H and I had it on for quite some time my computer has no damage or nothing's going on wrong with it but that's how I apply my paste so with the, my the CR1400 I don't think you have to remove the fan, but I'm going to show you guys anyway. If you do want to remove it, have these clips on the side. You just like pull it down and bring it towards the outwards area from the us uh, the fan. So once you pull it off, it comes right on up, and it's the same thing to put it right back on. Once you want to put it back on, you put the clips back on and just squeeze and pull the sides down and like let it uh, snap right back under to where it came off at. Now what you want to do is take your CPU fan and put it in the correct way. Once you have it in there, you want to start screwing it in. Do not tighten up one side all the way. Slowly tighten up all sides. That's just how I always tighten up everything to keep it well balanced and nothing is like off balance. So you kind of get it in a couple threads on each side. And once you have it in a couple side, uh, thread it in on each side, I just go through and fully tighten it down. I do not like using power tools because that's how you can accidentally, you know, accidents does happen. You can script the boat and stuff like that. I like like doing it manually. So I go, you can use it, but that's at your own risk. So I like to go through and screw in each four sides. Like I say, get a couple threads in and then fully go back around and tighten them all the way down. Now that's how you have your CPU fan in. Now I'm going to show you where to plug it in at to give it power okay every motherboard is different I'm going to show you guys the correct location on where to put your uh, input in for your CPU fan it pretty much says it on my motherboard every motherboard is different for this motherboard this is the location right here that's the location now that you see it this is where I put it in that kind of see my hands but on the motherboard I just put it down in and that's how you install your CPU fan guys Alright, so thank you beautiful people for tuning in to my channel and watching this video. Hopefully, you learned how to install your CPU fan. And this has been a little unboxing with the CR1400 as well. But if you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to drop a like down. If you want to see more videos like this, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. You do subscribe, hit the bell icon so you get notified when I drop my next video. If you're looking for 
how to install your motherboard, the CPU, the GPU, case and stuff like that, and your power supply. Check the playlist in the description. I have uh, different videos on how to pretty much create your first PC.